Hello, welcome back to my channel. My name is Carrie Rad. If you are new here and you've been here before, welcome on back. If you clicked on this video, it's likely because you're interested in growing your own food. That makes me very happy because I'm very passionate about that as well. As a lot of you guys saw in March, I posted a video about how to build your own vegetable garden in your backyard. But also in that video, a lot of you guys asked me how to grow food in smaller spaces and how you can grow more food indoors because not everywhere is like California where we can grow food all year long. The comments on that video inspired me to do some research and find out more about growing food indoors and in smaller spaces. My search led me to Garden and I am so excited that they are sponsoring today's video because I cannot wait to share this process with you guys and this really great, simple way to grow food in your own house, right near your kitchen, so that when you are whipping up a delicious salad, which we are about to do together in a moment, you can just grab some fresh greens and some fresh produce right there in your own home and have it go straight into your meal. In this video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys the ins and outs of how to grow food using your garden. And I'm also going to share a recipe with you guys. It is a super easy, delicious salad. It's my go-to during lunchtime and I'm hungry right now. So let's get into it. Growing my own food with my garden. I have learned is essentially the easiest way to grow your own food. It was a learning curve for me because I'm used to growing food outside with natural sunlight, with some soil and dirt, and having it take a bit of time for me to get some plants and a bit of work prep-wise to get the plants to grow. But with my garden, it was pretty simple. The process has been simple. The box came to my front door, I set up my garden, and within a couple weeks, I already saw sprouts growing. The garden app is powered by Kelby, and it allows you to see water level, temperature, and light schedule all with a swipe, even if you are not home. So I went out of town for the weekend, and I was able to see with the camera in the garden machine how my plants were doing. So you can check up on them at any time. And as a dedicated plant mama, I like being able to check up on my plants anytime. Kelby takes the guesswork out of plant care by providing you with over 60 tips and tricks to keep your plants growing fast and healthy. It tells you when to add more water, when to trim the leaves, and when to harvest your plants and more. And in my opinion, one of the best things about the garden is that it has vacation mode. The garden's sensors and Kelby automatically set the LED light and water schedule based on natural sunlight and humidity levels of your home. There is no need to water or care for your plants while you are away. Garden vacation mode reduces plant growth to almost a standstill without any impact on plant health health or balance. Growing your own fresh produce at home is as simple as popping in one of the K-cups. There is no soil and no mess. All you need is power and Wi-Fi. Many comments on my how to build a vegetable garden video said, Carrie, I don't have a green thumb. Anytime I try to grow something outside, pests are all over it. I make a mess. I don't like being in the dirt. If that is the case, then this is perfect for you because there's no soil and there is no mess and no pests. Which Lettuce, for me, outside has always been the hardest to keep pests off. They really love spinach, they really love basil, they love romaine, and that was always really difficult for me. I was able to use a homemade pesticide, like you guys know, but with this garden, you don't even have to worry about that because you don't ever have bugs on any of your lettuce or any of your produce at all. All right, enough talking about it. Let's go harvest some veggies. And yes, I still use my harvesting basket and I've got my scissors in my pocket because we are serious about growing veggies. <laughs> As you guys can see, I have a bounty full of fresh, gorgeous greens. Here is some kale, which I'm going to grab a bundle of for the salad. I really love doing a mixed green. So I love mixing all these different tastes together. I'm gonna grab some more here. I'm also grabbing some butterhead lettuce. I'm snipping off some gorgeous green mustard. Harvesting your garden greens at home decreases your ecological footprint by reducing your reliance 
on factory farm produce, which is a really great sustainable benefit. I am going to be making a pomegranate garbanzo salad. The ingredients I will be using are my mixed garden greens. I'll also be using some cherry tomato, some red onion, a lemon, a pomegranate, and I'll pull the seeds out for some fresh pomegranate seeds, a little bundle of cilantro. I have my garbanzo beans that I will open and drain. Then I've got my olive oil, some pomegranate vinegar for a little bit extra sweetness. I've got some sea salt and some black pepper. All right, first and foremost, I'm going to cut some of this red onion. I am just chopping my cherry tomatoes. I'm going to roughly chop my cilantro. And then the very best part, cutting open the beautiful pomegranate And then squeeze some lemon, of course, before we add in our liquids and seasoning. Olive oil, our pomegranate vinegar, just a touch. Some sea salt and black pepper. I am so excited <laughs> to eat this. I am already salivating. <laughs> Not only does the salad look gorgeous, it's also very delicious. Lastly, another thing that I absolutely love about the garden is that it reduces waste. You can harvest just what you need and it also reduces CO2 emissions because your produce didn't have to travel far. It's right there in your home. You guys know how passionate I am about growing your own food and that is why I'm so happy to share with you guys about Garden. I am also ecstatic to share with you guys a $200 off code up until December 15th using the discount code CARRYRAD. So I'm gonna leave a link in the description box for you guys, use the code CARRYRAD and get $200 off up until December 15th. If you guys try out this recipe, definitely tag me so that I can see it. It's super delicious and also very easy to do. I am hungry now, so I'm going to go and consume this. But again, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you very soon in a new one. Bye.